JavaScript. This was done in 1996. The code looks like this. Here's, um, you can see Bill Dorch's name up there. And this, this code was maintained in 1997 when the web archive archived it. So I don't have the original version. By 1997, things like
progress in V8 to, to add something like ES4's optional types, but, but get it done, get it good enough this time. ES4 was too ambitious. Fourth edition tried to do gradual typing or optional typing. That was one of the reasons we abandoned it. It was too much it was research.
something better, which is based on template strings, and that's tag template strings, where you can write a function and call it the need for print. You can just put the function name in front of the template. Again, the template string can have new lines and AAA values. And the function will process the literal parts and the evaluated expression parts, the values, and it can sanitize them. It can same HTML tag template strings to prevent cross-site scripting attacks. You can have safe SQL to avoid SQL injection attacks. Something silly, right? Binary and octal literals. There, there were many things I did in a hurry based on the C language. I actually put octal into JavaScript in a confusing way. Octal base eight numbers Numeric literals are useful still for permission bits, for nodes, file system API. If you know units, you want to use octal still. Uh, binary has its uses too. Here are some fixes. In such a hurry, in the old days, I made global functions. Is finite, is man. They actually convert non-number arguments, arguments that are not numbers, to numbers. And if number, the, the argument is a string, it cannot be converted to a number, get this very strange, not a number value. That's part of the IEEE standard. It's in Java, it's in every language of note. It's in our hardware, but it, it is confusing. You get imprecision, you get uh, not a number is not equal to itself. And, and it's worse that these old functions, these global functions, convert their parameters. So there are new, cleaner versions, scoped by the number object,
and match the common forms. Not every combination, but the common ones can be combined. So there's no Java here. It's all JavaScript. It's all prototype. Here's a subclass, dog extended animal, and it adds a method, var. You can subclass further. You'll notice the super is being used to delegate up the constructor. that. 
WebGL JavaScript running as a bytecode, as fast as any of the safe virtual machine based bytecodes out there. This wasn't thought possible even a few years ago. This has taken quite a bit of work from Mozilla leading the way and then uh, Microsoft and Google and I think Apple on board. Uh, one more game. This is to close out. Um, this is uh, Unreal Engine 3, the sanctuary level. I'm going to show you the ASM.js first though if I can. Um, this is what it looks, the code looks like that the scripting generates. This is the, the pretty hand handwritten code in the prologue. Uh, if, you, if you write, if you look for use ASM, that's the directive. Uh, where is it? It's not finding it. I may have where I was trying to here. Anyway, uh, I'll try to show you the code because it looks like bytecode. Uh, here's the game. shows what GL off. Um, thank you. If you uh, follow this game, you can play um, collect weapons. Take it to the sound machine. Sneak up on your friends. There's a uh, multi-million line code base compiled by the script.